hello and welcome to today's video so today we are going to see the partial correlation coefficient in my previous video we have discussed a simple correlation coefficient and then that the last video we have discussed multiple correlation coefficient and today we are going to discuss partial correlation coefficient so uh, that in many times the correlation between two variables is only partially or is only partly used to the third variable. In such situation, we obtain the relationship between two variables, ignoring the effect of the third variable. This is known as a simple partial correlation. So now describe how to compute partial correlation coefficient using Excel, using the following steps. This the data we have that we have already discussed by last two video. That is the yield of curve, rainfall and fertilizer. Okay. And previous videos we have already discuss and compute it. this is simple correlation coefficient and this is multiple correlation coefficient and today we are seeing the partial correlation coefficient so let's see how it's doing in excel so the partial correlation coefficient of the yield say this is x1 and the amount of rainfall this one say x2 after eliminating the linear effect of the amount of fertilizer that is x3 okay and it will be denoted by r subscript with 12.3 right sorry subscript yeah it is okay so let's type the formula or see how it is work simple thirty eight minus b thirty nine one to my weight forty close this bracket this of minus what we are eliminating this So here we have the partial correlation between x1 and x2 after the eliminating the linear effect of the amount of fertilizer. Okay. So what we noticed? So here we noticed that the partial correlation coefficient between the yield of corp and the amount of rainfall after eliminating the effect of amount of fertilizer is 0 0.637. Okay, so it means that the yield of corp and the amount of rainfall are moderately positively correlated after eliminating the effect of the amount of fertilizer for the given data. Right now, see for the other one. Now, now we are going to see. We are going to compute the partial correlation coefficient of the yield of corp x1 and the amount of fertilizer x3 after eliminating the linear effect of amount of rainfall x2 that is denoted by r1.3.2 .3 okay Easy access, just copy and paste the previous formula and do the edit part over here.
So there we got the result that that it is revealed that the partial correlation coefficient between the yield of corp and the amount of fertilizer after eliminating the effect of the amount of rainfall is 0 0.911. It means that the yield of corp and the amount of the fertilizer are highly positively correlated after eliminating the effect of the amount of rainfall for the given data right so let's move with the uh, next so next we are going to compute the partial correlation coefficient that is r23.1 r23.1 Okay, so what is it? It is the amount of rainfall that is X2 and the fertilizer X3 after eliminating the linear effect of the yield of corp that is X1. Okay, so let's use the copy the previous formula and let's compute it. Okay. 40, 39, and we got it is in minus or negative so what we have noticed that the partial correlation coefficient between the amount of fertilizer and rainfall after eliminating the effect of the yield of the corp is minus 0 0.2 okay so it means that the amount of fertilizer and rainfall are poorly negatively Related after eliminating the effect of the yield of the corp for the given data. Hope you like the video and understand the concept between on the partial correlation coefficient. So we have covered all the three types of correlation coefficient that is simple correlation coefficient. Then we have discussed the multiple correlation coefficient in last video, and today we are discuss the partial correlation coefficient okay hope you like the video and if you like the video please hit the like button and if you want to get the updated video update in your screen so just put the subscription button that's all for today hope you enjoy it thank you thank you for your watching bye bye